Distinguishing fact from opinion. Navigating the information jungle. Hello, English learners. Today, we're diving deep into a crucial research skill. Distinguishing between fact and opinion. This skill is not only essential for academic writing, but it's also invaluable in our daily lives as we navigate a world filled with information. Let's get started. At its core, a fact is a statement that can be proven to be true or false. For instance, the Eiffel Tower is in Paris. You can verify this by checking maps, visiting Paris, or consulting authoritative sources. On the other hand, an opinion is a belief, judgment, or personal view and cannot be proven true or false. For example, the Eiffel Tower is the most beautiful monument in the world. This is subjective and depends on individual tastes. You might be thinking, okay, but why should I care? Well, when you're conducting research or even just reading the news, it's vital to separate facts from opinions. This ensures that, one, your argument stands strong. In academic writing, grounding your arguments in facts makes your work more credible. Two, you make informed decisions. In life, discerning fact from opinion helps you make decisions based on reality, not just someone's viewpoint. One, language clues. Opinions often use words like believe, feel, think, or in my view. Facts are typically more straightforward. Two, check the source. Scholarly journals, reputable news outlets, and official reports are more likely to present facts. Blogs or opinion columns, as their names suggest, usually contain opinions. 3. Ask questions. If a statement raises questions like, according to whom, or based on what, it might be an opinion. Now, a quick activity for you. Here are three statements. 1. Chocolate is delicious. 2. Chocolate is made from cacao beans. 3. Most people love chocolate. Which are facts, and which are opinions? Pause. If you guess that the first and third statements are opinions and the second is a fact, you're right. Remember, what might be delicious to one person might not be for another. And while many people do love chocolate, most is subjective. Distinguishing between fact and opinion is a cornerstone skill in research and in life. As you continue to hone your English reading and writing skills, always keep this distinction in mind. We hope this video has been enlightening. Happy researching, and see you in our next lesson.